how have you been with Andy? Are you going to get married? Get married? No way. We're not even together. But Andy has left over at your apartment, hasn't he? Well, we're only friends with benefits. What does that mean? That means he's just my sexual partner. Wow, you're so progressive. I don't think I can accept it. Come on, it's a current trend among teenagers. Let me give you a brief introduction and you will know more about it. I guess most of you have sexual desire. Have you ever had this experience? You want to have sex but without a partner. In this situation, some people may try to find a sexual partner to satisfy their desire. Hookup has gradually increased its popularity in recent years. As you can see, our topic is friends with benefits, hookup culture among teenagers. Let's begin with introduction. Hookup culture seems to become more common, especially in college campuses. Students prefer to enjoy the excitement with sexual partners instead of developing a long-term relationship. Our research questions are listed as follows. We want to know the reasons why hookup becomes common, people's perceptions toward hookup, as well as the pros and cons of sexual partners. We conducted a survey to learn more about the public's opinion of hookup culture. Our methods can be divided into two parts. The participants include 115 people from the internet, and we also carried out a questionnaire with 10 questions. As our research question mentioned above, our first question, why does hookup become common in young generation? To know the current phenomenon of hookup, we ask people who never have hookup experience. There are some reasons that encourage them to give it a try. Based on this chart, around 60% of people only want a regular sexual partner instead of the, relation instead of the pleasure in a relationship. Another reason is curiosity to sex because of the lack of sexual experience. As for people who have such experiences, it turns out that most of them feel happy and satisfied, which arises their desire to do it again. In short, regardless of hookup experiences, all of factors increased popularity of hookup among teenagers. Our second research question, what are people's perceptions of sexual partners? In the following part, we are going to discuss people's different attitudes when facing different people who have hookup experiences. If the person is their friend, around 40% will try to advise him or her to stop this behavior, and over one-third only want to gossip about it. From this result, we can see that people hold a more negative attitude when facing the hookup experiences of their friends. On the other hand, when finding that lovers had sexual partner before, over half of the respondents won't break up when they feel a nut in their heart. Although the public consider hookup somewhat inappropriate, ending the relationships won't be their choice. But as the rising acceptance of casual sex, almost 30% think previous hookup doesn't matter. Therefore, hookup turns into a trend and will lead to breakup. Finally, our last research question is, what are the positive and negative influences of hookup? Next, let's talk about the advantages of hookup. As you can see the result from this chart, around 38% think sexual partners don't have the pressure of future commitment. However, a boyfriend or a girlfriend may bring you the pressure to get married. Another 38% say hookup can vent their sexual desire without spending money. Some people may choose to find prostitutes, but it may cost them a lot of money while sexual partners are free. How about the disadvantages? About 77% of people worry that casual sex may increase the risk of getting STD since you don't know if the person is clean. Besides, around 60% fear for leaving others bad impressions or their future partners won't accept this behavior. The worst thing is that they may meet someone who has evil intentions. According to the result, we can infer that teenagers understand the importance to protect themselves from getting disease and meeting horrible partners. Furthermore, young generation care how people think of them, so the impression to others is also a major concern. In conclusion, we've learned the main reason of the rising popularity of hookup is that teenagers don't want to get attached, but they are curious about sex. 
Thus, hookup became a new form of relationship. We also reveal people's attitude toward hookup varies when facing their friends and lovers. Most people will try to stop their friends from involving in hookup activities. But when facing their boyfriends and girlfriends, people will choose, won't choose to break up after knowing the truth. Finally, the major benefits of such a partner is the clear boundary without pressure and commitment. On the other hand, the risk of getting disease is regarded as the biggest downside. Eventually, we live in a more sexually open society and hookup culture can spread more rapidly than we expect. For those people who want to try hookup for their own pleasure, self-safety is the most vital thing. In this case, everyone can enjoy the happiness without any future worries.